Welcome back to my channel. This is Nyjah and I am going to be doing a budgeting video for you all today. This is actually going to be a recap of November's budget as well as I'm going to show you all what our December budget looks like. So let's go ahead and get into it. Alright, so we had already pre-filled out some categories here for fixed expenses that we have and I'm just going to go ahead and fill in the actual amounts. So for our mortgage, end up being $1,392.06. For homeowner's insurance, it was $180.61. Hulu was $6.48. Our internet bill was $100. Our mobile phones, they never change. It was $80. Ready Fresh, which is the water service that we use, was $50.91. And we have actually talked about canceling this and just going to the grocery store and filling up our water bottles because this it's increasing every month now. All right, so our water utility bill, that was $52.77. Security, that was $38.97. And then our electric bill was actually a lot lower. It's, it's almost looking like what we used to pay like a couple years ago. It went down $125, which is awesome. Great, great amount of savings. So we've got $1,400 plus 180 oh, Let's see, see that. Plus 646 plus 101, 13, plus 80, plus 46, 91, plus 60, plus 39, plus 160. So I'm just going to put down here 2073.50 was the budgeted. So let's do the actual amount. $13.9206 plus $180.61 plus $640.81 $80 $50.91 $52.77 $38.97 Plus 125. So the actual is 20. So not bad at all. Down here. 2680. And then for the notes down here, I'm just going to put cancel ready fresh in December because we want to go ahead and if we can save that $50 then that would be awesome all right so let's go ahead and switch on over to what December is going to look like for December let's go ahead and put up here December 2020. All right, so again, for our fixed expense, we have our mortgage. That usually comes out on the first of the month. And that will be, it rarely changes. Okay, next we'll have insurance. And I'm using red here because of December, Christmas time. Let's see, when does the insurance come out? Let's see. Usually comes out on the third. And that's about 180. 
sometimes it's been varying because we've been receiving some um, credit for when everything started happening early this year. So like for October, the bill was only 145, but then now it jumped back up to 180 for November. So we'll see what happens with that. So next we have Hulu and that's going to be, I'm just gonna do 648. Then our internet. And I'm putting this down for this month, but in actuality, I've already um, paid it for the month. It's 101. And I could get into more details about that later on. So the next bill for us will actually be in January for our internet. So this will be 80 and this is fixed this never goes beyond 80 so we're not doing the ready fresh so we're gonna I'm just gonna leave that off um, water utilities is 60 security system is going to be 39 and then our electric I don't know what it's going to be but I'm just going to say about 150 I'm going to say 150 that was a nice surprise of it being 125 though so I think I think this is it for our fixed expenses. We have mortgage, insurance, Hulu, internet, mobile phone, water utility, security system, electric. Um, again, I probably could add in groceries because that's a fixed expense. We know how much we're going to be spending every month. But just like um, a little bit for November, I went over to like a tiny smidge. Um, if you don't know, our grocery budget is $200 per month. I have stated that in some of my other meal plan videos. And if you have not seen or checked some of those out, I will um, include the iCard up above so that you can check out some of those videos. All right, so this is pretty much our December budget. And um, at the end of the month, I will reconcile everything put all of the actual numbers down and um, put the total actual fixed expenses, write any notes that I have for the month, um, as well as I think for December I will include uh, some type of side hustle income. But if you enjoy this type of content and these type of videos where it's talking about budgeting, paying off your mortgage, meal prepping, saving, things like that, please make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Also hit that notification bell and also give this video a like and a comment, please. It does help keep me in the feed for YouTube, um, as well as reach out to more people that um, may not know about my channel or anything like that. So until the next time, all right, bye.